Welcome back. So, when we left off, we just needed to interact with this, and we're gonna hold forward and move on. I'm not sure if you can die there. I think I almost did. If you can, that'd be... <laughs> that'd be funny. <laughs> Nearly ruined everything there, that'd have been hilarious. So we lift the boat, there is a wall that's going to spawn in front of us on the way, so just be ready to pop it. You just shoot it once, it will go back down. Uh, shoot that. Pretty sure that's not faster. Oh well. So this next segment, I'm pretty sure you have to interact with the broken ladder in order to interact with the crank again. So we can go ahead and nab that. Because I was here for a solid 10 seconds and the prompts didn't come back up in my first attempt. So I'm pretty sure that's what you have to do. Feel free to prove me wrong, though. I'm always looking for ways to improve things in my tutorial videos. Like I said, this is all the stuff that I just kind of figured out on my own. I could very well absolutely be wrong in a lot of instances. So yeah, the reason we didn't interact with the breakable crank the first time is because it just disappears when you come back to it. Some uh, quality of life game design there. Okay. Alright, and this puzzle, a little hopped, hard to optimize speed wise, but we'll figure it out here. is also not skippable here. Uh, this would be the place to save if you're looking for the Moreau uh, Sashimi boss achievement, I think it's called. Got it. Um, but like I mentioned in the first part, these save points, I'm not sure exactly how the bosses are checkpointed. So save scumming may be unnecessary. You might just be able to hit restart at some point. But um, yeah, don't take my word for that. I just kind of got these achievements immediately in my first time doing this. All right, so for Moreau, he actually does not take damage until he starts to charge you, so you don't need to waste any shots. I guess I gotta do this. Okay. You do have to shoot him once to trigger him, I guess. As soon as he starts walking, I know that's when he starts actually life. taking damage. Disgusting. The exit's up ahead. Oh, nearly stepped over your line there, Ethan. <laughs> Just gonna get the winged key attachment. Can skip this. Go back out the way you came. <laughs> Take a left, use a six board, wick, winged unborn key. <laughs> Continue holding forward, and yeah, that's that's Moreau's segment. It's pretty short. If you don't dilly dally. And then we're on to Heisenberg. I am likely going to screw multiple things up on this path. <laughs> so just bear with me. <laughs> Oh, wait, we don't have Heisenberg yet. We got the Stronghold, so... Even more opportunity for me to do something wrong. But thankfully, I'm pretty sure you can ignore most, if not all, the enemies on this pathway. I just take care of them for my own reassurance. So...
for the stronghold segment, any killing could be unnecessary. But I'm going to do it anyway. <clears throat> so I don't want people following me as a thing. So the reason I unlocked the gate earlier is so I could just run straight through and not have to worry about anything. Also why I killed the pigs so they wouldn't charge me and damage me and waste a second or two. So we did that ahead of, a t ahead of time. Because I believe if you did not kill the pigs they'll still be there. Potentially. Potentially not. I feel like I did not kill them for my first attempt, and they were still there. And they subsequently screwed with me because of it. So to reiterate, reiterate whew, um, you may just be able to beeline it straight to the end of the stronghold, kill Urius, and then you're done. But for my own amusement slash reassurance, I'm going to go ahead and kill some folks. hate to get sniped with an arrow and combo killed. Like that's gonna happen. Kind of I just don't want to waste time not dealing with something I could have. Also you can see Ethan's body in this shot if you just angle all the way to the right. Not sure if that was intentional, but it is something that happens, so it's kinda neat. So something I'm not sure can happen or not. Um, I've noticed the lichens do climb the ladders. So you could get surprise killed while climbing it. If you're playing on a higher difficulty. Potentially. Did he clip through the wall? So you do have to wait for the door to open, go ahead and just kill things so they don't uh, surround you and create problems for you. And for this next segment, next segment, we're just going to beeline it through, kill the enemies right in front of the door we're going to be going through, and then we're going to move on. Mostly the big guy, that's the dude I'm worried about. And for this, we just need to kill two that are going to be in our way. I don't want to this get must blocked. Be and then we'll continue killing. Also, I'm not sure if it's true for all guns, but the Magnum bullet uh, can kill enemies standing in a line. Yep, I was afraid that was happening. <clears throat> you can get just cheap hit there. It happens. Just roll with it. Okay, big guy. They're there, why not? <clears throat> what I meant when I said I wouldn't be picking up any treasure items, I meant out of the way treasure items. One stop watch, stop going away on me. This is once again scripted, just hold left and there's no way to speed it up. I 
assume. Coming up, we have the Urius boss fight. Um, he does not die until he leaps down to the bottom floor. Um, but if you have infinite ammo, go nuts. Just anyway. That's not good. He takes forever to get down here, too. Magnum shot, and he should go down. Eat shit. And we're done with the stronghold. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the plate just so I have money for another playthrough because I'm still upgrading my guns. Skip that. And this. Take the boat, you just have to hold forward, it's a straight path. Little minute turns here and there. So no, you don't have to just hold forward. I'm completely incorrect. <laughs> Whoa! That's new. Never done that before. I was mashing for optimization, and I s still missed it. Alright, so you do need to unlock this gate, if you haven't already. And now, we're gonna head back to where the Duke is, turn in your flasks, and then we move on to Heisenberg. And won't that be fun? I believe this is a forced cutscene. It's my nope. great pleasure to I was see wrong. you return alive. This is forced. Unskippable. However, this is skippable. What was that? So the game does unsprint you when you go across the bridge here. Nothing really important about that, just be aware What's of it. What's going on? I'm assuming because it's loading something, but I have no idea what it is because we have a loading screen here. that cutscene. It takes like 30 seconds if you don't. <laughs> so I don't remember where the doorway spawns here. I feel like I'm also always facing different directions.
I was looking down, my bad. Don't worry about the kid, Ethan. It'll be fine. Ha! Just get your ass across the bridge. Ah! Ethan Winters. Welcome. I didn't think you'd make it past daughter Moreau, but I suppose you survived worse back in America, hmm? I like you. I'd like to speak to you about Rose and Miranda. So a funny thought oh, I had on. about Heisenberg in this Don't entire worry. segment is it reminded it's me of chapter 13 in, in uh, Final Fantasy 15. <laughs> Just the entire segment where Arden's berating you over a loudspeaker. Uh, Made me think of that. Uh, That's skippable, and that is skippable. That, mash, yeah. sprint, turn right. Turn right again. Crouch through that. A dead end. And go through the chute. Damn it! What was that thing? So the cool thing about the Magnum, and I may have just been getting lucky, this is casual mode after all, uh, doing headshots I believe still insta-kills these enemies even though they have head shields. Shooting them anywhere will insta kill them, actually. Now that I think on it. Is the, like, the minimum damage for a fully upgraded Wolfsbane is like... 20, like 2,500? I don't remember exactly what it is, but it's over 2,000. No matter what body part you hit. This place is messed up. I've got to get upstairs. Alright, so for this section, um, once again, killing might be unnecessary. But I don't want to deal with the uh, chainsaw guys, or the drill dudes. I don't, I don't want to deal with that. We will be using the shotgun to open doors, however. Except for this one, it seems. Uh, that way. Turn left, and yeah, this is the segment where I said I would most likely screw up my path, so do bear with me. Place is awful dark and somewhat labyrinthian. Quick turn. I'll let him stand up. I also want the drops from those guys. They, they sell for quite a bit of money. One, two, three. There's no way to speed these up, unfortunately. It's going to make it and play out every single time. Even though, for what it's making in Seems useful. this particular instance, it doesn't seem like enough metal pours in there. I always find that so strange. There'll be an enemy waiting for you at the top of the stairs, just be sure to be ready for him. Oh, I thought I saw something else. Screw it. You don't need to do that. These ones are pretty slow. Really? Owie! 
was unbelievably dumb of me. Can't believe I did that. <laughs> that was the easy one too. How did I? How do you fuck that up? Oh man, that was funny. <laughs> it was like the second one. <laughs> That's embarrassing. <laughs> they don't do much damage to you in casual, thankfully. And unlock that for future use. You can go ahead and get the hammer pieces if you want to. It does sell for quite a bit of money. Uh, wrong way, me. That's later. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this guy just because he's in my way. I don't want to deal with him. Turn. We're gonna go back through the door we just came through, Oop, and go this direction, actually. Nope. <laughs> I thought that said cog. Alright. So I am also gonna deal with this guy, just because... Could sneak up on me while dealing with this I dude. Thought we could do it. Join forces against that bitch, Miranda. Truly, truly disappointing. All right, hang a right. Let's shoot this. Play. She took me. Took us to be her children. Go up the stairs here. She locked us away in the He's gonna spawn. Decades of being forced to serve her. Some people might rag on Heisenberg's voice acting, but you know what? It's for a the character like that, it's so perfectly odd, my in my opinion. The strong will destroy the weak. That's the way of the world. His inflections are so perfectly me, strange. What a freak! Yellow quartz, it's very valuable. I'm just not gonna skip it. It's worth like 10,000 monies. Put him on his knees. Oh! Did not get that guard up in time. Immediately turn left, crouch there, and then you're, you have plenty of time to do this, by the way. You don't have to hurry that quickly. But uh, just make sure you don't lollygag too long. Go ahead and activate the elevator. I'm not sure if you need to do this. But uh, it's a little too far forward to go without knowing <laughs> for certain. So I go ahead and just do that. Got a long way to go. So I might be able to optimize this ladder here if I just, uh, 
Nope. Can't sideways walk off of it. So for some ladders, if you walk off sideways, it won't do the animation of Ethan climbing down. Could save you a second or two. Miranda thinks we're nothing that but one, shit. I'm not sure if it works the same way. Oh, she doesn't care for us? No. Go ahead and kill this dude. She's long lost all her humanity. He can sneak up on you. I must destroy her. Man, I don't even need to kill him. Give a shit family drama. Let's kill the two closest to the hole. I'm gonna move on. And proceed through here. Alright. Ah, shit. So there's four of them, they're all on different sides. This is where you will prove whether or not you're a good shot. And then go ahead and deal with these guys. They are directly in your way and very strong. However, if you hit them in the reactor, it's just one shot and they're down. With a fully upgraded magnum. I forgot to shoot this one on the lower level. Also, for the unfenced sections of this rail, I'm not sure if you can fall off, but I don't want to test out if I can. <laughs> I imagine I can, because I can fall off in other segments where there is not a rail. take up more time than is necessary. Uh, you can go ahead and get the ball mold if you want to spend time doing that. Those uh, crystal skulls are worth quite a bit of money. Be sure you're holding L2 for this segment. You got time. So don't panic. <laughs> That was close. <sighs> Once again, the game unsprints you for the walking you're about to do here. So you uh, have to go kind of slowly across this pipe. Understandably. I don't know why there's a ladder in a place that's right behind a suction fan. Which I can only imagine is used for cooling something. <laughs> but I don't know what. Machinery in this place doesn't make a whole hell of a lot of sense. Alright, but we are coming across a breaking point. I'm about to... Uh, head back down to the bottom floor once I get the key mold. So, thanks everybody for joining. I will see you in what's hopefully the final part. Should have enough time to get everything else done. But hope you guys are enjoying this. Hope you find it helpful. And I'll see you in the next part. Thank you very much.